Yo, guys, sorry for the dog water quality. I just used the Roblox recording option because I didn't know we could do it, guys. But we got it, guys. We got the mystery key, man. This is the run. So if you guys want to know what loadout I'm using, I'm using one Max uh, Ultra Epic Dagger and then two Ultra Epic Fans. And my buddy has a uh, Legendary Staff, Legendary Dagger, and Legendary Fan. Now, uh, one of the secrets to use, guys, is it's actually easier in a duo if you are if you uh, both have the same weapons. The reason being, guys, is when the enemies stun, they only stun one enemy at a time. So there's actually a new method you can use that's even better than this, is you have two alt accounts join in and leave on wave one. What this does is, now the odds of them stunning your unit is like, what, 50% instead of guaranteed with solo. Actually, it's actually technically now it's like one one fourth instead of guaranteed. So what this is gonna allow you to do, guys, is do almost 30% more, like a big chunk of DPS more, like 20% maybe, 30% if you're lucky. I'm not sure how often the stun thing happens, but there you go, guys. That is the secret method on how we got that extra edge. Cause you guys know if you've seen my streams, I've been like barely there, guys. We've been like 1%, 2%, 3% left. And yo, we finally got him, man. Big shout out to Feels Fresh though. He does have a little bit better weapons than me, but the thing is I'm running double fan, so I'm not. it's not like I'm not carrying my own weight. So uh, yeah, guys, you can see here, we just kind of figured out that we are going to beat it together and we are getting pretty hyped. Uh, it was kind of weird though, because it was kind of sketchy going to the halfway mark, but then after the halfway mark, it kind of went like really fast. Um, yeah, you can see we have like 48 seconds here. Um, we're just kind of talking here about like how we think there should be a slight nerf to make it a little bit easier. But honestly, now that I've learned this new method, I don't think it's too bad. Now, if you do run this with other people, it's going to hurt your candies. But if you run it with alts, what's going to happen is you're not going to lose any candy if they leave on wave one. However, you'd have to do all the setup, which is kind of a pain. So there you go, guys. That is actually the secret to reaching wave 50. I thought it was getting all legends, but actually ultra epics can do it if you do the alt glitch. Now, uh, don't tell Fruity about it. I don't want them to patch it. But there we go, guys. We finally beat the event, not with any glitches. This isn't, a, I guess it's kind of a glitch. But, uh, I don't, I don't know. Well, we, we used it actually with no glitch. This was the no glitch method. I was teaching you about the glitch method. So there you go, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. And yes, guys, we got that mystery key. So I'm going to be grinding these for you guys. And uh, maybe I'll give away some once they become tradable. Blind Spot Out, yo. Make sure you subscribe. Peace.